Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name's Ebra and thank you for being here. Today I'm getting Bantu knots. If you don't know what they look like, this is what they look like here. Um, I did try to do it by myself the other day. I think I woke up at like 3am for no good reason. I thought, let me be productive. Let me change my life. And so I tried doing Bantu knots. I done like the right thing. I split it, split it, split it. And then I... I, I ended up getting like three done and I realised it actually wasn't working so I gave up and then I booked an appointment with my lovely hairdresser which is at five. This is the, these are the photos that I showed her. So you've got this one here which is more like my hair texture. There's this one and then this one and I sent her those because I like the parting on that. And yeah my appointment's at five. And it's now 20 past four, 18 minutes past four. I'm going to actually leave at five because I'm just so strategic. I know by the time I get there, like quarter to six, someone's still going to be in the seat. And it got me thinking, is that me being strategic or is that my hairdresser thinking I'm going to be late? And so it tells me to come 45 minutes before the actual time. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Like, do I arrive at quarter to six because I think there's going to be someone on the chair? Or does she tell me to arrive at five because she knows I'm going to be late and arrive at yeah <laughs> because it always works out i always get there like 45 minutes later and i'm literally next up normally i'd get there bang on time normally i'd even get there early and i'd be sat there for like an hour no offense like yeah life happens sometimes and normally when i'm doing my hair it's the only thing i actually do that day so it's not like um annoyed or like oh i've got places to be like i haven't <laughs> but it's just sitting there i don't want to feel awkward and someone told me it's not awkward till you say it's awkward. So let me stop talking and let me actually just leave now and arrive at five. How about that, Deborah? Yeah. So yeah, keep watching if you want to see my hair change from this to Bantu knots. I've come back on here just to tell myself, editing Deborah, that this hair best stay in for at least two weeks. Whether you like it or not, keep it in for two weeks. I'm saying that because you're always blow drying your hair. Your hair could be breaking, so just keep it in for two weeks. I'm on the seat. I'm glad to be on the seat. I'm excited. I've shown her the pictures just to be triple, triple sure and i am you guys are on the mirror right now by the way i'm not gonna talk about what time it is i'm not gonna do it i'm gonna keep that to myself because Don't make me sad. no no i need 1000 before you get some yeah yeah is that how you do it yeah yeah i'm at 50. <laughs> i think like come. people get like <sighs> did i bring <laughs> to look <clears throat> <laughs> I think it's because it's a new style that whatever it even turns out, I like it anyway. extremely tight I like it in fact I love it it's just very tight <laughs> 